Hi, my name is David Chernow, and this is Teresa, and we're from TriChem. TriChem is a manufacturer and distributor of facility maintenance items, and today we're here to talk to you about floor preparation. That's right, Dave, and whether you're using our concrete patches, coatings, or sealers, preparation is key. It is key because in order to ensure longevity and durability, the floor preparation part of the process is the most important part of the process. And so whether you have oil saturated or pre-existing coatings, we have a solution for all of it. And the most common one is? Shot blasting. Steel shot blasting is the most common and preferred method of surface preparation for the application of sealers, coatings, or polymer overlays. Using this method, you will clean and profile the concrete, removing dirt, latents, curing compounds, sealers, and any other contaminants. Shot blast systems produce very little dust, making it an ideal method for sensitive environments like food and beverage plants. The process involves preparing propelling steel shot at the substrate surface at very high speed. The impact of the shot breaks up the concrete surface, creating a profile. That's right, Dave. And another case would be if you had a flat concrete surface where you have existing coatings that are peeling up, that is where you'd want to diamond grind your floors. Grinding is primarily used to remove coatings, thin polymer overlays, and deposits. In grinding, rotating abrasive stones or discs impact the surface at a high rate of speed. The stone or disc is applied under pressure and moves across the surface until the desired effect is achieved. The grinder is guided in a circular, overlapping path producing little, if any, pattern. You can use a handheld right angle grinder to remove epoxy coatings around walls, edges, and corners. Sometimes you don't have access to mechanical machinery such as shot blasters or diamond grinders. In this case, we have a chemical etcher called Bulldozer. Bulldozer is a hydrochloric acid mixture that removes lime, rust, scale, metal corrosion, scum deposits, oil, and grease stains from your concrete. It also removes excess mortar and concrete from metal surfaces. It etches the concrete to provide a suitable surface for maximum adhesion of floor patching or sealing products. Simply brush the mixture onto the surface and allow it to sit for five to 10 minutes. This allows it to react with the cement and pit the surface. It will also give your concrete a clean and new look as well. Bulldozer can then be rinsed or spray washed away with water. If you are in a plant that cannot use acids on the floor, our TriPrep Organic Salt Etching Compound is the perfect solution. And if you have heavy grease or oil saturated concrete floors, our Tri Oil Stop Primer is the perfect solution. Dry Oil Stop is a primer that you can use on oil or grease saturated concrete floors prior to applying top coats. It penetrates deeply to tie up and lock in contamination, leaving a clean surface for patching or sealing. Using Tri Oil Stop will prevent delamination of epoxy coatings, sealers, or patching material due to oil or grease saturation. It is compatible with petroleum-based oils and greases. It's a two-component cold tar epoxy amine undercoating. Clean the surface first, mix the products together in a five-gallon bucket with a hand drill, and apply with a roller, brush, or spray. It's that easy. Teresa, no matter what your floor prep problem is, we have a solution for it. That's right, David. And for more information, you can reach us at 1-800-456-6255 or our website is try-chem.com.